Today, we're getting chicken fingers. Oh, I love chicken fingers. And I'm getting chicken fingers from two restaurants that specialize in chicken fingers. Lane's Chicken Fingers and Raisin Cane's Chicken Fingers. Welcome back, Brick Eats. I'm your host, Brian Brickman. Ah, baby. Baby, I'm starving. And I've got chicken fingers for days. Now, I've always wondered what the difference is between these two restaurants that seem so similar and have such a similar name. Both restaurants were founded in 1994. Lane's Chicken Fingers was founded in College Station, uh, which is why their colors are maroon like the Aggies. Raising Cane's was founded in 1994, but didn't actually open a restaurant until 1996. Man, this dude had to go to LA. He became a boiler maker on an offshore drilling rig and made a bunch of money. And then he actually went up to Alaska uh, to do some commercial fishing so he could raise the money to start it. But he started it at the north gate of LSU in Baton Rouge, Louisiana. Now, Baton Rouge means red stick. Yeah? Did you know that? Hey, I took French in high school. And people always ask me, Brad, if you live in Texas, why'd you take French in high school? Because the class was 70% female. That's why. I mean, obviously by far my favorite class. Anyway, so we have one Aggie restaurant and one LSU restaurant. And as a Texas Longhorns fan, no, I'm not on board with either one. No, I'm kidding. I'm kidding. Hey, good food can come from either one of these places. So they both have a mascot. Raising Cane's is actually named after his dog. Check it out. Uh, Lane's has the Astro Chicken. And the Astro Chicken was their spiritual guide. And in 2021, they promoted the CFO, and that is the Chief Finger Officer. <laughs> I like this Astro Chicken. I, I, everybody loves dogs. I get it. I get it. Uh, but but Astro Chicken is pretty cool, right? Anyway, let's get to the food. First of all, I got unsweet iced tea from both restaurants, so we can see how it is. Now, this has there 30 years with see Astro Chicken there, and then on the back it says it says giving the finger. <laughs> <laughs> since 1994 that's okay that's clever i like it uh and this one has their cool logo raids and it doesn't say anything clever on it okay canes lanes i wouldn't say either one of them are great iced tea and they're both okay they're both meh okay not bad for a fast food place but not great. You know what I'm saying? I got the four finger combo at both of them. Here's Lane's. Okay, here we go. We got a piece of, of toast. We've got the sauce. We've got fries. And we have four chicken fingers. And then here's Cane's. We have the toast. We have the fries. We have coleslaw. The chicken tenders. And cane sauce. Okay, now the most important part of both of these is the actual chicken finger. Let me grab a chicken finger. This is a Lane's chicken finger. Good size. Not bad, not bad. And then we have a comparable uh, Cane's, Raisin Cane's chicken finger. Now both of these were about the same price. The Raisin Cane's actually came out to an even 12 and the Lane's was $11.57. So, about the same price. Let's try. Mmm. Good juicy chicken finger. I like that breading. So they both have good juicy chicken finger. And both have good breading. Then we need to check out the side. Raising Cane's Texas Toast and Lane's Texas Toast. Now, uh, Lane's looks a little overcooked. We'll go for a little less cook on that. Well, this has some more loaf bread here. Mmm, mmm. Raisin Cane's has a chewier bread, for sure. Lane's bread is good. It'd be better if they wouldn't have cooked it so much. You know what I'm saying? Now the fries. I know you're all asking. You're all like, I want to know about the fries. They both have crinkle fries. Look at this. Both of them have crinkle fries. Here's Lane's crinkle fries. are much thicker than Raisin Cane's crinkle fries. Now these are good, but you know I love crinkle fries. It's my favorite kind of fry. Lane's has uh, a little bit bigger. Mmm. Well, I gotta tell you, the both fries taste about the same, but
but Lane's fries are bigger. So that is, uh, that, uh, that's a point for Lane's, I can tell you that. Now, here's what I want to try. You know, if you watch my channel, you know I love Raisin Cane Sauce, okay? 32 ounces of cane sauce. You could just drink it. Mm. <laughs> Get them in that sauce, baby. Oh. Oh. <laughs> what about Lane's sauce? Now, I will say Lane's offers a variety of sauces. Not just the regular sauce, but they had a bunch of them. They have gravy. They have all kinds of different stuff. So, they definitely have more options. We're raising Cane's with cane sauce. Mmm. Mmm. I love that. I really do. That cane sauce is fabulous, man. I could drink it by the gallon. Now, what about Lane's? Mm. Lane's sauce is sweeter. It's got kind of a kick to it. Try another bite. That lane sauce is good. There's definitely a spice to it. Like a, it's heavy in the pepper. I gotta tell you, after eating both of them, I mean they're both varies. They're so similar. I mean, really, the only difference is now Canes gives you coleslaw, which is pretty awesome. And I don't know if you've had the coleslaw, but it's good. I do love coleslaw with my chicken fingers. Mmm. I don't think I can pick a favorite. If you would have made me pick which one was better before I came, I would have I would have said it's gonna be Raisin Cane's because Raisin Cane sauce is absolutely phenomenal. But the Lane sauce, even though it's similar, like I said, it's, it's got a little peppery kick to it and it's got a little more sweetness. And I actually like it a lot. The chicken's about the same on both of them. Juicy chicken. Great breading on both of them. Raising Cane's, you get coleslaw. Uh, with Lane's, you get better fries. That's pretty much it. Raising Cane's has 700 locations, coast to coast. So you probably have one close to you. Um, Lane's only has about 19 locations open. But it looks like there's a lot of coming soons in five different states. Uh, so they're growing. I would totally eat both of these. I think they're both so similar. It really doesn't even matter. I would probably, in the future, I'd probably just go to the one that's more convenient to me. They could be the same restaurant for all I know. Hell, they might have the same suppliers. That's okay. I've been in real estate for 20 years. I haven't had an original thought in my entire career. This video wasn't even my idea. This was a viewer's suggestion that I should do this video. See? So it's okay. We can have similar restaurants that compete against each other. Just go to whichever one's closer to you. Hey, thanks so much for watching this video. Thanks so much for watching all the way to the end. I appreciate you. I appreciate all those likes, comments, and subscribes. Hit that next video if you want to watch the next one. And until next time, keep getting chicken fingers from Lanes or Raisin Canes, and we'll see you.